What up? It's PBJ. It's me back at it again with another video. So I know it's been a while, but this time I have some excuses. For one, it's been like rainy, like a lot of the days and the days that it hasn't been rainy. Like I've just been wanting to stay inside, you know, play video games, watch some shows. But you know what? Now we're back on that, you know, stay jacked mentality. We're going to be going out again, going on an adventure, but, um, basically, um, I picked up, you know, a new hobby, some basketball. I've been playing basketball recently. Oh, um, got the, hold on. Got the basketball right there. Just got that yesterday, for like five bucks. Also got some new shoes recently. Got these right here. Pretty nice looking shoe. Also got these. These are so clean. Like, look at these. Such a cool shoe. Honestly, there's my yin yang. Ooh. So definitely gonna be wearing these today. It matches the outfit the best. I'll show you all the outfit in a minute. All right, y'all. So this is the full outfit. We got, you know, my tank top, shorts, and then these cool shoes. Like, look at those in the mirror right there. Pretty cool, you already know. So now we're just gonna continue on with the adventure. Go outside, you know, get the bike out and, you know, start biking around a bit. But one more thing I figured I would let you guys know right before I actually leave on that adventure. I recently got my driver's license. That is so cool. So why I'm really excited for the driver's license is, honestly, I worked hard for it for a long time. I'd constantly, you know, like beg my mom to let me drive and, you know, practice day in and day out. Got really good at reverse and parallel parking, took the test, and um, I did the parallel park and the reverse park completely perfect. I didn't hit any cones like or anything bad. I didn't take any extra turns, any extra backups, anything. I just did it perfectly first try. It was awesome. I passed. The guy said my driving was solid. So, yeah, it's like if y'all want to congratulate me, say congratulations, PBJ, in the comments. And without further ado, we're going to go on an adventure. And y'all, it is so strange biking again after not biking in like a month. I had to repump the air in my tires because over time, if you just leave your bike sitting there, the tires like lose air. Um, and it's so weird going no hands. As you can see, both my arms, hands are holding the camera. Man, I gotta start doing my cardio again. I'm a PBJ is a lot of shape. It's all right though going no hands though i got pretty good when i was biking every day i was practicing uh trying to make no hands like my normal um like biking but man gotta get used to it again i suppose but yeah that's just like the first thing i gotta say Whew. i'm gonna continue on also it's like 70 degrees and there's like a nice breeze feels so nice like hasn't been like this in a minute it's been like 88 degrees every day so, yeah. <sighs> Head across the road kind of riskily right there. But what you call it though, it's gonna be a good day. And even if it isn't, it still was anyway cause I'm blessed enough to be alive today, you know? And that's how y'all should be thinking. <sighs> so yeah, I'll see you in the next clip. Man, I really do need to start biking again. It's been like 10 or 20 minutes since I started riding. And, whoo wee, boy already kinda tired. But I'ma keep it going just cause I got that determination. But man, if I was anybody else, I would've already given up by now. Whew. Man, whoo. Yeah, I mean, bike rides teaching me some things. Perseverance, man. And here's another thing I wanted to talk about actually. It might be windy, so you might not be able to hear me that well, but perfection. If you have a goal in mind, just remember this. You don't have to do it perfect. Just do it. You know what I mean? Get it done. It's not about doing it perfect. You're, it's inevitable that you're gonna make mistakes on that journey, you know? On this bike ride, I like crashed into like three trees that were like, overlapping the sidewalk and like crash but like my head went through all the leaves and it was kind of 
just a little devastating. <laughs> Point is though, you don't have to do something perfect, just get it done, right? You might be, I don't know, combing your hair and then you drop the comb. Just pick it back up and start combing again, you know what I mean? Like, stuff like that, like little things, don't let it get to you. It's all about completing the task at hand and doing what you wanna do, nothing else. So, get after it. And the more you do while failing, the more you'll realize failing doesn't matter. It's just a stepping stone. So keep that in mind and we're gonna keep it going. Man, y'all can probably see the sweat all over me. I started this bike ride. It's like a hair on my nose or something, but I started this bike ride at around 3.13 and it's now like 3.50. <laughs> I was intense biking for like 20, 30 minutes, just going crazy. And honestly, like, it feels amazing. Like, probably see the sweat, man, listening. So, you know, I put in that hard work, man. It feels amazing to be out here again, to be doing this, to be pushing my limits, man. It's all I ever want to do is push my limits, you know. But, what you call it? Again, with the perfection thing, though, you don't have to be perfect, all right? Just get it done. You don't have to be, you know, how do I put this? Oh. Sorry. It's all right. So you don't have to be perfect, right? You just gotta get it done. Even if you bump 300 times, if you got it done, you can say that you finished it, you know what I mean? So at the end of the day, just get it done and you can be proud of yourself and you can work hard and you can improve yourself better yourself all that good stuff so keep that in mind all right we're gonna keep it going the stuff going on downtown at the park i usually go to so decided to stop by sit by the water get a nice breeze going a lot of people here and let me tell you my legs are fried I played basketball with my friend uh, alex yesterday i'll introduce y'all to him in a future video like a 1v1 or something but Maybe even in this video, but my legs are cooked from all this exercise lately. So I'm gonna sit down and maybe I'll have something to say when I sit down. I took a little break, was sitting down for a minute. Woo! <laughs> I almost fell over. I stopped paying attention for half a second. You always gotta pay attention in life, man. Anyway, I was uh, sitting down for half a second. Um, watched the water. Saw this, uh, I think it's called a pontoon boat. Saw it, uh, what you call it? It had a loud speaker. It's kind of cool on the one of the guys that was waiting there, I think I caught him in the video, he was like, wow, that speaker was loud. And I was like, I agree. And he walked off and then after a little bit after that, I walked off and then uh, spoke with the lifeguards for a second. They were pretty cool, some girls. And then, uh, yeah, I mean, it's a pretty good day. Just chilling. And now actually, since I've been biking for a minute, it's actually like I've gotten used to it pretty much now. So, kind of proud of that. Let's see if I can make this sharp turn. There we go. Proud of that because, you know, getting the cardio back. Now you need cardio. You know, the heart is the most important muscle in the body. So it kind of pumps blood everywhere else, you know, so, and other functions. Whew. But it's pretty important. And uh, what you call it. So you gotta take care of it, of course but whew, man yeah I mean can't really think of much else just concentrating on biking while I'm recording um any thoughts um I don't know it's a bit cooler out today which is very nice because the past couple days it's been kind of 
like 88 degrees, which we don't like 88 degrees, man. That 88 degrees is not fun. Also, that's that tree path I was talking about earlier. That kind of, I just went right through it earlier, which was not fun, which is kind of like I'm saying, you know, you gotta go through it anyway. If you got a goal, just do it, you know? You make a mistake, you drop something, you pick it back up and you keep working. So that's the kind of mentality you gotta have if you wanna move forward. Cause it's either give up or move forward. There's no other choice. So why wouldn't you just move forward? You know what I mean? You can either sit there, complain about it, cry about it, be sad about it. And don't get me wrong, it's okay to cry, but you have to move on, you know what I mean? You gotta understand and accept what has happened. Even if it's something you feel like you can't accept, you gotta move forward anyway, because that's how life goes. They say life is unfair, but if it's unfair to everyone, wouldn't that make it fair? Think about that, think about that. Food for thought. I always wanna make you think in my videos, you know what I mean? So, not sure what else to say as for right now. I don't have too many thoughts. But I hope y'all are happy that I'm recording again, making videos again. You know, I'm back, out, I'm back on my grind, back on my biking grind. I'm really out here doing this, you know? So I hope y'all have been getting that work in too. And if y'all been slacking a little like me, just pick it right back up and keep going again. See y'all in the next clip. I'm recording this clip approximately 10 seconds after that clip. I just had a thought. I can't wait till one day I'm biking around town or something. And people go, hey, that's BBJ. I want to be in your video or give me a shout out or, you know, they recognize me. That would be so cool. Like one day I'm going to work hard to get there. Everybody will know me. And, you know, you work hard, you get results. So work hard, you know. But I feel like the fun of it is the journey. Although it is a cool thought though, you know, having everybody recognize me, it's a cool thought. But the fun of it is definitely in the journey, like this, these bike rides, these videos, this is what makes it fun. But also, Taco Bell just recently released fries. So, you already know, in a segment of the video, we're gonna be eating those fries. You already know with me, y'all have been watching the channel. The true OGs. Y'all already know. So I'll catch y'all in the next clip. So I'm not sure if I said it before, but when I make these videos in between clips, what I'm doing is I'm biking around, like usually intensely to get a good cardio and a good workout in for my legs. And I have some music just blasting, you know, cause it just gets me in the vibe. I don't like wearing headphones cause they might fall out. And I don't like having to deal with that. I just like focusing on biking. So I keep my phone in my pocket and I have it blast my music, right? Point is, I was just, I started blasting my music, you know, started going, and I realized that I was starting to get slower, just now. That I'm getting tired, that I'm getting fatigued. The second I realized I started getting slower, I knew I had to make this clip. In any of your journeys, you might start getting slower. You might start making progression slower. Let's say you're hitting the gym, right? You were going up by 10 pounds each time for a PR. You're going on bench press. You were hitting 195. Then you're hitting, or let's say you're hitting 190. Then you're hitting 200, 210, 220. Then you get to 230 and you can't lift it for months. And that plateau starts getting to you. It starts getting in your head like, oh, am I ever gonna be able to break another PR? I was breaking them so quick before. It's not about how quick you break them. Think about what you've already achieved. Think about the the garden that you've been planting. You've been planting flowers in there. You've been planting nice plants, crops. You're going ham on that garden, right? This entire time. Also, that's a nice car. And you've been planting this garden for so long, you don't even see it, because it, it became natural to you. I had to cross the road, but point is you've been planting this garden for so long you don't even see it it became natural to you you gotta learn to adapt not only that you gotta learn to accept basically oh um, sorry it's hard to concentrate as i'm biking you gotta learn to keep moving even if it doesn't feel successful you gotta learn to keep going 
no matter what happens because at the end of the day it's not about the prs like i said earlier it's about the journey it's about what you had to become in order to be extraordinary you have to become extraordinary so keep that in mind keep working hard man keep moving forward i will preach this and do what you want to do what brings you joy with no insistence on the outcome because there are things that'll be around every day what do i mean by that today i had the choice do i sit down on my butt and play video games or do i come out here and make this video do i go on this journey with no insistence on the outcome of it so you know what i did i said to myself okay well video games will be there every day okay well the outside will be there every day so i said to myself okay what won't be there every day me there's a chance that i might be not alive tomorrow and as cruel as that might sound listen you gotta do what you think you would regret not doing and that the answer is always going to come to what brings you the most joy whatever brings you the most joy is what you're going to regret not doing now you got to think to yourself are you improving yourself with what you're doing or are you constantly bettering yourself are you pushing your limits every time this doesn't even have to apply to working out if you're playing video games are you getting better at that game are you truly enjoying it are you moving on to the next thing hold on the cross road ask yourself these big questions man what do i want to do what brings me joy do i care what others think about it am i doing it only because i'm expecting something from it or am i doing it because i truly enjoy it and want to get better and then you gotta ask yourself this what's my perception on it how am i looking at things am i seeing everything i could have done with this goal have i done everything in my power and if i have should i let it go or should I keep pushing forward, hoping that something happens? Now, the context is going to be different every time. But ladies and gentlemen, never give up. Unless you have physically done every single thing in your power. Now, there are certain things where it's not about giving up, but it's about understanding that it wasn't worth it. But that doesn't really apply to goals. That applies more to different situations. Woo. Going, uh, curb. Uh. But listen... I'll keep trying to motivate you every day because it that's what I truly enjoy doing. I like spitting my wisdom. You know, I like to be on here and talk because it's like motivation for me too to look back and see what I said and listen and really understand the message, you know? But work hard and you will get those results you're looking for. I know all of you are looking for something. So let's hope you can get to it, right? Whoo! What's up? So carrying my bike up the stairs where I live, man. That was rough. I feel like I'm even more tan now that I'm inside, but man, I gotta start doing this more often and then it just becomes easy like it was before. But yeah, I mean, it's a good day so far. I decided I'm gonna do a little live stream before I go to Taco Bell. See how everybody's doing, you know, positive vibes, probably what I'll title it. And, uh, yeah, I mean, whew, man, that bike ride was awesome, though. Whew, so I just finished up the live stream. Thank you to everybody that was there that showed up. Now I'm going to go get some Taco Bell. Y'all already know. We got this new freeze. That's good. Y'all already know what it is, man. They got fries now, y'all. They got fries. Mm. Those fries are so good. Y'all. I just absolutely smashed that Taco Bell down. I plundered it, if you will. Absolutely plundered that Taco Bell. 
that was amazing the fries were amazing everything about it was amazing the fries with the cheese was even better the new freezy they had was good it was all good you already know Woo. it's a good day it's a very good day so what you call it you already know oh uh, <clears throat> gotta cross over a lot is what it is but uh yeah i mean i can't really think of anything else i'm literally just vibing on my bike it looks like it's gonna rain soon so i don't know how long this bike ride will continue i can feel the breeze which is so nice it was so hot earlier i was sweating but we're chilling now um uh, yeah that's pretty much it not really pondering too much just doing what i want to do with no assistance on the outcome <laughs> excuse me but yeah thanks again for everybody that showed up to that live stream you're all real ones and for the ones that couldn't make it you know i'll start periodically live streaming you know let me know in the comments if i should start live streaming more and uh, we'll see about it so yeah i'm hyped to get back into making videos you know i'm hyped to be in the be in the game again you know but yeah i'm very hyped that i got my driver's license so now i just gotta save up for a car so you know i gotta hard grind this stuff man i gotta start putting my best foot forward on youtube and everything try to make as much money as the money as i can while inspiring others because this is my job and it's what i love to do i got that two-in-one combo you know what i'm saying it's awesome dude live out your dreams man work hard for them i'm grateful for what i have so yeah i'll see y'all in the next clip man y'all something i just realized i don't realize how fast i actually bike until i bike behind like some random people and like i just have to physically like slow almost all the way down like i bike like very fast so maybe that's why i tire out but that's good because you know that's how i got conditioned in the first place honestly i don't think i've lost very much of my conditioning i think it was all in my head it's like everything else in life though it's all in your head it's you against yourself that's one big boxing match mma match whatever you want to call it against yourself just keep that in mind y'all mind over matter you already know quick flex that left bicep looking good lately but remember it's all in your head you're never not looking good you know what i'm saying and if you really aren't improve yourself you know what you got to do so go ahead and do it there are no coincidences man everything happens happens for some kind of reason and opportunities they'll come at you randomly you got to use them to your advantage man all right so what is your what is the name of your band we're easy enough at easy enough band on instagram Go follow us. This is Bitch for Sympathy. All right. Oh, Stuck in my thoughts, eh? Hey. Not enough for you. You got me fucked up. Got me fucked up, hey. Hey.
let it be, yeah. underrated actually <laughs> dang that was awesome y'all what are your names steven adams noah werner y'all give them some recognition for real Shit, Woo. yo as you just saw that band was pretty cool it's called easy enough i'll leave their uh, at and in their instagram at in the description so if you have instagram you can go ahead and follow them that was awesome <laughs> um that was pretty cool they got some good tunes uh, they played more songs and then they even let me try out their uh what you call it their bongos and that like box drum thing i'm not sure what it's called y'all musicians in the comments let me know i got that one dude that comments on my videos sometimes his name is like organ choirman or something like that so that guy let me know uh or anybody that knows about music let me know what that was called and whatnot but anyway, um, what you call it? If y'all want to see them on the channel again, let me know. Give them some recognition. I'm going to put the title to be like something about their band. Because that was awesome. Um, yeah, I mean, here's what it is. Uh, honestly, this is going to be the end of the video. I know, I know. You want more video. I'm just kidding. This is probably already too long for some of y'all. But hey, it was a good day. Day ain't even over yet. I might make another video. Don't worry, don't worry. BBJ is not lost. But hey, I'm going to start trying to go on these adventures more. It's literally raining right now. It's like tiny sprinkles every here and there. I might go back and see that band again. They're going to be here a little bit later. But you know what? It's a good day. And uh, yeah, so... Y'all already know, like, remind me that y'all still watching, comment for the algorithm, and let me know your thoughts on the band and everything, and um, yeah, just overall, comment what you thought about the video, and uh, that should be that, so like, comment, subscribe, do that one thing I always say, hold on, gotta make sure I don't get ran over, like, comment, and do that thing I always say at the end of every video. Which it, oh, hold on, it's dangerous. Let me start a new clip. Finally, finally, now that I'm out of danger and um, the bugs are not in my face. Okay, they're in my face a little bit. They like to come out right about now. Point is, like, comment, subscribe. Stay jacked. And I'll see you in the next one.